Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you how to add motion tracked boundary lines in your real estate video. So let's roll the intro. So I've opened up the drone clip which I'm going to be using in today's tutorial. I'm going to quickly set the in and out points to this video. I'm also going to rotate the video slightly to make the horizontal lines of the boundary straight in relation to the video frame. What I'm going to do is click the camera thumbnail button and save this thumbnail that I've captured. I'm going to open up Photoshop and import that thumbnail. I'm going to use this as a reference to where the lines need to be and the size of them. I'm going to place four red lines on each side of the boundary. I have turned off the thumbnail layer of the property as I'm only going to export the red lines as a .png with a transparent background. I'm sure there are plenty of other ways to draw these lines for the boundary and to get better quality lines, but for today I'm just going to use Photoshop. We're back now in Premiere Pro and what I need to do now since this is a moving shot is track the red lines to the property, otherwise the lines will just be floating around the property, which is not what we want. I'm going to open the video clip into After Effects by right clicking on the video. Here I'll click Track Motion and tick the boxes Position, Rotation and Scale. You will see these track points appear, so what you do with these is move them to a noticeable point in the image. Here I have something on the lawn and an object on the track trampoline which I'm going to put in the center of the boxes. The software will motion track what's ever inside of these boxes and we'll use this data to then motion track the boundary lines. Click the play button and After Effects will work its magic. I'm going to create a null object, select edit target in the tracker panel here and make sure it's selected null 1, press OK and now click apply, select X and Y press OK and here in the composition you will see little red points in the shape of a square that is now staying in the same position in the video. I have now imported the lines into After Effects and dragged them into the composition. Here click on None and select Null 1 which pairs the image of the lines to the now tracked Null object. I'm going to make a few adjustments rotating the lines to make sure it fits over the actual boundaries of the property and to make this flow better I will make the lines fade in and out. Here is the final result. This is how I add motion tracked boundary line graphics in my real estate videos. I'm sure there are plenty of other ways but this is how I do it. Thanks for watching this tutorial. I hope you found some value from this video. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. See ya.